last year. It was really funny. She came in and played right in this room. And I remember thinking to myself, well, we'll, we'll wait and see how she sounds. She's an eighth grader, and I know she plays really well. And I had uh, our new junior high director in the room with me. And when she played, it was just kind of jaw-dropping and just, okay, well, I see. Well, we will have you playing in symphony orchestra this year. Yeah. I've heard stories that I went to a concert and I said, oh my gosh, it's a violin. That looks really cool. I want to play that. And so then my parents enrolled me at the Bruce School of Music and I was there for four years with Christy Kelsey. <laughs> Um, I mean, she was surrounded by by it with, from the before she was born. When I, you know, I was uh, I was still performing and teaching. Uh, well, when I was you know pregnant with her, and then it went, you know, from day one she heard me practicing and heard my students taking lessons. probably my biggest accomplishment and they gave me a huge scholarship so that was kind of a reassurance that I'm doing the right thing. It's in a weekly Saturday program where 30 musicians I think we go there from 9 o'clock to 6 o'clock and there's two hours of music theory in the morning and then two hours of chamber music so we each have our assigned group. I am in a string quartet with three other girls um, I think I'm not the youngest, I'm the second youngest in First Island. And then we have lunch, which is fun. And then we have two hours of orchestra, and then an hour and a half of enrichment. Is, um, to, to say, how is it helping her, it's, it's putting her really at a just, um, at a national, almost world-class level. She's just playing a very high level of technique. Um, let's just say it's helping her a lot. <laughs> She plays at a level to where uh, I've been playing gigs around town, um, you know, as a professional, and I'll look over and I'll notice that Katya is also there, even just as a freshman in high school, which might kind of go to describe how well she plays. Well, you know, I was her uh, designated pianist from, from day one. Uh, you know, she was uh, uh, doing her first um, the Suzuki Book One uh, graduation recital, and that was already we were playing together um, for that. It's, I used to practice with her when I was younger, so I would cry a lot because we would disagree. But now since I've started practicing by myself, I've stopped crying, so it's more of a fun and professional relationship, I guess, when we play together, because we both have the same ideas. One of the, the, the best you know, experiences that I can have as mom, the time you know we've played for many years now, and we kind of feel each other as well. Katya wants to be here and is, is just like any other West High student, um, she, um, except that she just has this tremendous ability. So what's fun for me is that uh, while Katya is in orchestra, she, she gives us so much in terms of her playing ability and um, she's able to lead, she's able to play. Um, but I think what's great is that we're able to just see how good of a person she is and just how humble she is. And she's just uh, just like any, anybody else that goes to the school. It's just she has a very exceptional, exceptional ability. I think she's, uh, she has um, an incredible, s strong, passionate reaction to music. And so she plays with lots of emotional, beautiful tone on the violin. Um, 
and she's very fast as far as learning and the site reads very well. But uh, again, the gift is not something that is, you know, that's packaged. You know, so it can go in many, many different ways. And so uh, through the years of hard work and very good teachers that she's been fortunate to have, now I think she's at the stage where, where she pretty much can take herself to any level that she wants.